from the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. You can see that we have a little bit of a dry area pushing into the region, although with a little bit of trace of some more winter weather as we lead in later throughout the weekend and leading into early next week. But if we look at our current conditions outside the Walker building, we can see that we have 41 degrees with some mostly cloudy skies. With winds, winds remaining fairly calm, so you don't have to worry about the wind chill factor nearly as much. But if we look at temperatures uh, throughout the rest of the state, we can see that they're fairly similar conditions with temperatures in state parts, like I said, 41 leading into the southeast western part of the state and downtown being 42 and 45 in Pittsburgh with some colder temperatures up to the northeastern part of the state, like here in Williamsport and in Scranton, reaching 36 and 35 respectively. And if we take a look at what the radar was like this morning, we can see that there was some precipitation that built up in the southwestern part of the state and moved up through the northeast, but that has since dissipated out. And we can expect into the future leading into this evening that more snow showers could find their way building up into the southwestern part of the state and possibly reaching up to the more northern sections of the state. As we look throughout the rest of the, the outlook, though, leading into Friday, we can see that early morning, we can see that the winds start to shift more northwesterly as we see them come off the lake with some possible residual lake effect snow bands building into the northwestern part of the state. And winds will keep up and be persistent as being northwest to bring some chillier temperatures as we lead into Friday afternoon and leading into the late night hours. And we could see some low double digits or even some single digit temperatures throughout the contrast. And that pattern will continue to persist leading into Saturday morning where temperatures remain fairly chilly, but there is some possibility for some little snow spots building in up to the north and northwestern part of the state. So, and as for a more broad outlook to see what we have coming on pushing in, we can see that leading into Saturday night, we have this little system that could be pushing into the eastern part of Ohio and the western part of Pennsylvania, which could possibly bring some snow into the area. But if we look through the rest of the day on Sunday leading into Monday, we can see that our system has pushed up from the south, bringing in some more precipitation being more widespread over the state as opposed to being more regional. But we can see some heavy amounts pushing in leading to, as it, the system pushes up through Pennsylvania up into the northeast and into the New England area. And as we look just for today, we can see we have a high expected of about 43 degrees with winds remaining fairly calm, like I said, with some possible rain and snow showers mixing in. It will depend on the timing of that cold air mass moving through, but we can still expect some sort of rain and or snow showers as we move in throughout the day. And leading into tonight, we can expect those rain showers, if anything, to be out of the area as that rain turns into snow as we see a low of 17 degrees and the snow starts to build up to 10 miles per hour still from the northwest, but temperatures will remain fairly chilly. And as we push into tomorrow, we can see for Groundhog's Day, the skies will remain partly cloudy, so Phil has a chance or not to see his shadow. We will yet see on that. But we can see a high of about 21 degrees with the winds remaining from the northeast at 10 to 15 miles per hour, which could bring the wind chill down into the low single digits. So make sure you're watching out if you're going outside to make it to work out for that. Now, as we take another outlook for the rest of the weekend and leading into the week, we can see that there is that little bit of a warm up leading in for the rest of today and um, a little bit of more of a warm up as we see out through Sunday and leading into early next week. And whether or not Phil may or may not see his shadow is still up in the air, but we can see some more wintry weather, wintry weather as we lead into Sunday and even to mid to early next week on Tuesday and Wednesday. From the Penn State Campus Weather Service, I'm Casey Chapman. <laughs>